Yep, 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 yep. My substation.com. Substation streaming.net. My substation. Substation live. Yes. I got the homie Conway in the building. Yeah. I got Benny in the building. Right. Two chain. The real two chain. Thanks. Fellas. What's happening? What's good with y'all? You know the same shit, man, you know. Mm-hmm. No, no, one monkey don't stop no show. Don't yes, never sir. stop. You know what I mean, fuck what you heard or what you seen or what you saw. Mm-hmm. You know I mean, pay attention to what you looking at now. You know, don't nothing stop. What's uh, what's new? Immediately off uh, off top. What uh, what misconceptions need to be cleared up? What's going on? What's uh, what's the movement? What's coming up next? What's uh, popping right now? The first, the first misconception is that it's probably been one for years. Is that is that the boys don't the boys ain't the boys you know what I mean like mm-hmm. the boys don't don't mob or the boys don't fuck with each other you know what I mean like Come on. niggas is day one niggas uh, basically niggas relationship don't consist of music so even if we not doing music together or if we took a break or whatever that don't that don't got nothing to do with how we operate on a, on a personal level mm-hmm. you know what I mean so mm-hmm. but I'm working I know this nigga working <laughs> I, I'm motherfucking uh just put the best ever out. You know what I mean, it's on yep. that piff dot com. Mm-hmm. You know I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm in, the, uh, I'm in the lab. I'm in the kitchen. Yo, yeah, it's been so long since I did this, my nigga. <laughs> Real shit. Where I'm mm-hmm. my nigga right now. Yeah. Um. Yeah, you know, I'm just, you know, what I mean, I'm working, man. I'm just getting that that physical therapy ready for everybody, man. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Streets is, 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 is they almost ready. You know what I mean? Um, and I got the Devil's Reject. I'm gonna drop that. I'm just gonna drop that digital. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. That's just that's just a, a you know a, a a collection of all the you know what I mean some of the illest um illest shit I ever said on 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 a beat. You right. Know what I mean? Right. It's like this what the streets want to hear. I, I think niggas get it twisted and, and get it you know what I mean get it mm-hmm. fucked up when they mm-hmm. hear like American Greed and they hear like. You know the 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 lane I was in on that because I, I was you. like drinking all kind of syrup and smoking all kind of gas, living uh-huh. in Atlanta, the big ass. You know what I mean? Condo. Right. You know what I mean? Enjoying my life. You know what I mean? Right around 2013, Camaro. You just can't understand just it. Fucking all type of bitches. Mm-hmm. So they didn't understand where that music came from. They didn't. They didn't know about all of the couches I stood on and the speed I popped in. A, in and some of the most prolific clubs in Atlanta. Real shit. You know what I mean? With uh-huh. my shit playing. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? Shout out to DJ Nando. No doubt. DJ Esco. You know what I mean? Magic City. No Nando, doubt. that's Onyx. You know what I right, mean? Right, right. Shout out to DJ Funky and the homies up at Strokers. And no you know doubt. what I mean? My nigga DJ Infamous holding compound down Velvet Room and all the places you go. But right. I say that to say this. They got it twisted with all the auto-tune and, 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 the, and the swag and the, and, the, and, the, and the wave I was on on that joint. Mm-hmm. So... I wanted to give them this to just let them know that niggas can't fuck with me. No doubt. Now, uh, I mean, the streets fuck with niggas. That's, I mean, not even to be debated. It's, uh, it's been a lot of, uh, a lot of talking, a lot of fake talking, and, uh, the, I, I don't know, um, real talking, I guess. If, uh, if, if it come out of nigga mouth, that's, that's the way I look at it. Been a uh, wax or some. I mean, it's been jabs being thrown out, let's say, for the last, uh, six months or so. You know, right, 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 right. How y'all feel about uh, you know, just the, the 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 culture as a whole. You know, being if it has to deal with you or not, um, you know, just the 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 culture of a of a rat beef. You know, from a for not so much from a from a vet perspective. You know, but just intelligently going about the business of music. You know, well, per- personally, I think that that's that's gonna always be a part of hip hop. You know, what I mean, the, the competitive mentality. That's gonna always be a part of the uh, the culture. And where I stand on it is, I'm fifty fifty. I ain't gonna lie. You know what I mean? Like I, like I said, it's it's a part of that. You know what I mean? Like we, niggas is competitive. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? I hear this mm-hmm. nigga get on a song. I wanna I wanna come my hardest because I know what he bring it to the table. Mm-hmm. So I wanna bring that same energy, if not more, to the table. And right. I just to be honest, just how I got how I am right now. I've been around dope niggas my whole life. You know what I'm saying I was raised up in the booth. Around this nigga, so right, like around right. one of the best niggas, so I was always competitive. But on the other hand, you got a lot of niggas. You got a lot of niggas who uh doing like make believe shit. You know right. what I mean? Like niggas right. is trying to, niggas is trying to like going with their gangster personas, is trying to create like 
they really tough or they really killers and really trying to mm -hmm. act like that. You know what I mean? And I, and I don't respect that. You know what I mean? Like, first and foremost, I'm going to keep it all the way 100. We street niggas, you know what I mean? We're right. G shit. So right. when you get on songs and you talking crazy and you doing all this, my first, my first, right, my first thought is like, right, was Gucci with this nigga? Let me you see. Know what I mean, uh -huh. was Gucci with uh -huh. this nigga. And 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 I'm not I'm not a super tough guy. So if you just on some shit like, nah, it ain't like that. I'm just here and I'm da da da. -da. Okay, I can respect that. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna bite that ass. But if like some niggas be coming out of pocket like. You know what I mean? What's I the uh, what's, what's what's the problem though? Why you think that that now more than than ever, uh, people think it's acceptable to just say whatever and damn near just be like it's not gonna get checked because it's definitely happened a lot more now than ever. Only because only because people see that's the that's the that's a, a prime way to get their name out there. Mm -hmm. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? It's like a it's an instant thing. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like. Like the, we we was having a conversation about it. Like somebody could put something up, no hits. Right. Put put a battle shit up, mm -hmm. and it's hits. Right. And they and they feel like as another artist, you could you could understand that. You know what right. I mean? So, right. But to me, that shit ain't always acceptable. You know what right. I mean? Right. It's like we we also was talking about this. Remember when niggas was like, when LeBron get on the court, LeBron not saying Lil fuck Kobe or fuck this right. nigga. He just balling. He right. just putting up numbers. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That's how we did what we did. We put up numbers. It wasn't about. Sense. Fuck this nigga, cause if this nigga shine, I'ma shine as well. Right. You know what I mean? It ain't about taking another nigga light, but if you do that, if you do that, you know what I mean? Go ahead and do that. But like right. you, you, you fuck it with some niggas who nice with that pen. You know what I right. mean? Right. Like niggas who nice with that pen. Right. And, and like I said, I I even hate to say this, but it's, it's it's the truth. Like even outside of being nice with that pen, like if niggas getting on some crazy shit, like you Come fucking on. with like real niggas. You right. know what I mean? So you gotta accept whatever you do. You know what I mean? Like. Mm -hmm. Certain niggas do it. Certain niggas jump out there, and they be like, "No, nah, it ain't like they know. How, they know how to be cordial, but certain right, niggas right. don't know how to be cordial." I mean, but it's all hip hop, man. I love hip hop, man. I eat, sleep, drink this shit. You know right. what I mean? It's what I do, though. Now, uh, on the uh, on the on the wax side, on the rap side, what uh, what does it take to take you there? You know, what does it what, what does it take for you to 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 put your feet in it? You know, in the event that um, you know, somebody. Even even if they don't call you out, you know, just maybe they say something that you feel you need to speak on, you know, or it's maybe somebody continuously is doing some shit like, man, you know, they just they just gonna keep on game. Nobody, you know, when does it when when when's your point when it's like enough is enough and I gotta say something, or do you just sit back and let somebody else do it? Um, for me personally, um, it depends on the motive behind mm -hmm. it. You mm -hmm. dig what I'm saying, mm -hmm. like. Um, if you just a, you know what I mean, a fuck nigga just trying to, you know what I mean, hop in a lane and get your name known and get a buzz and, you know what I mean, just generate some bullshit energy, like, off me, like, right, I ain't right, even going right. to respond to you, I'm not even going to acknowledge you, I don't right. even see you, yeah. you don't even exist to me, you know what I mean, but if to. I feel like, you know what I mean, um, it's coming from a sincere place and that's really how you feel and you really... Um, want to challenge me in that fashion, then I'd be more than glad to like bite a nigga head off. Mm -hmm. Pause. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. That's where I come from with me. Like a lot of niggas just is just fuck niggas. I'm gonna right. keep it hundred with you. Mm -hmm. Like niggas is just fuck niggas. Just trying to just find a fuck, trying to find a lane, my nigga. Like you know, you know, niggas hate the Patriots, my nigga. <laughs> right, right, right. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Like niggas hate. The, how uh -huh. many niggas hate Miami Heat right now? Like right, right, damn, right. niggas gonna keep winning. Like right. we ain't slowed down or got old or, 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 or lost no no momentum. That shit make it tougher for y'all. You think? You know, I mean, it's 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 I, it's a, it's an oversaturation of the bullshit. You know, does it does it make it harder for the the authentic for the cream of the crop to stand at it the do. top like you it once do able to? It do because now it's like it's so much of the bullshit that um I think a lot of people gravitated towards it. You know what I mean? And it's like. You know what I mean? It's like, look at the, the, the you know what I mean, the authentic shit, mm -hmm. like it's foreign. Mm -hmm. know what I mean, you look mm -hmm. at that sideways, mm -hmm. like, you know what I mean? The real shit, like the niggas who really nice, you look at, right, right, like, right. it's to the point, like, niggas don't even want to hear that shit. Like, I heard, I heard a motherfucker say some shit like, man, you, th you know what I mean? Niggas don't want to hear all that rapping ass shit y'all right, niggas talk right, about, yeah, man. We yeah. just want to hear it. Uh -huh. We just want to hear it, man. Uh -huh. We just want to, we in our zone, man. Right. Throw a beat on it, just swag yeah. on that bitch, nigga. Yeah. You feel me? So it's like, it ain't even... It's some for some people they only want to hear, but we do it so genuinely that we can we can still um, 
be relevant mm-hmm. and still be ill like we is and show our potential. Now, personally, do y'all think that y'all get the respect that y'all deserve no. from a, uh, you know, from a... <laughs> no, absolutely not. We do not get the homage that we two kings supposed to get paid. Definitely. Facts, because, like, like, we deal with this a lot. Like, a nigga uh, have his little run. He, in the summertime, will come. He will snatch his bitch income tax check. Right. And he put his little posters up. He put his little flyer together. And he right. Put- <laughs> well, just look at the just look at the energy that's been generated behind that fuck shit. Like right, right. I'm already knowing where this shit coming from and it's uh-huh. derived from like the niggas who've been throwing jabs. But just look what them little bum ass jabs did right. for niggas. Like all the all the shit we done did and the work right. we done put in. Right. You know what I mean? Peyton Manning of this shit. Right. We done had a Peyton Manning season. We get injured and we just it's over. We washed up. Right. <laughs> retire, you're a bum. You know what I'm saying? Okay, like Andrew Luck. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I don't fuck with niggas like that, man. I dig Go it. ahead, my bad. I ain't mean to cut you. I dig it. But like, you know what I mean? But like I was saying, it's like niggas would put their little shit out and, and immediately feel like they on niggas level. You know what I mean? Right. Like right. I, I swear I don't I don't mean to sit up here and sound all high and mighty, but mm-hmm. I do this shit. You know man, what I mean? It's my life. It is. I do this shit. If I if I had a, a, a penny for every time a nigga say say like yo, only niggas in the town really do shit is me, you, and Conway. Like, if I had a, if I had a penny for every time nigga said that. Right. And, and a, and a right. lot of times, you know what I'm saying, and a lot of times, my homie Black used to say that. Rest in peace, D Black. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? He had a valid mm-hmm. conversation. But a lot of times, it was like brand new niggas. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Brand new niggas. And I'm like, damn. You know what I mean? Like, niggas can't take nothing away from, from shit that niggas been doing because niggas done put in a lot of work and blood, sweat, and tears behind this shit. And you just can't come up and have people... Riding your way for the instant. Right. Most likely it's your right. family and friends. Right. And then, you know what I mean? Like, niggas got fans, like, that stretch beyond this region. You know what I mean? Like, places niggas never been. You know what I mean? That's a blessing from God. Right. So, for niggas just to feel like they doing their little thing. And like, yo, man, we should do this. We should do that. Nah, right, right, right. Nah, right. That's, yeah. that's, that, that, what that, what, what makes you think that. that you deserve to do that? You know? Yeah, not, yeah, not, yeah. Not, not for you, but how you. Yeah, yeah, yeah right, I, right, I right, you. right. I feel That's you. what I said, cause, right. cause, the, cause I'm the same nigga, you know what I mean? I'm the right. same nigga who, who was running around this motherfucker in uh, in the motherfucking uh, late '90s, early 2000s, mm-hmm. sitting on the couch in the studio. Right. I ain't get to turn on the microphone. Right. I, I had to wait. Right. I'm the same nigga, man. Mm-hmm. And then when I got on the microphone, niggas was fucking with me. I had to do that. I was yep. walking around my CDs in the knapsack. sack. Right. Motherfucking the ankle bracelet on and shit like that, trying mm-hmm. to down my CDs. Mm-hmm. Motherfucking no, no, no shit with no, no uh, pictures and nothing like right, I'm, right, I'm right. writing with a marker right. on my uh-huh. shit, trying to down my shit. So then niggas gradually they started to fuck with me. So don't ever, ever, ever think that you just instantly right. where a nigga at. You know what I mean? Yeah, got a lot of work to do. Like I got a lot of work to do, but don't do that, my nigga. I don't do it. that. What's the uh, what's what, what's the difference in the in the fan love? You know, just in the in the general supporter love outside of here. You know, in opposed to what you get coming from here. Uh, well, basically, out, outside of here, it's, it's, it's obvious that niggas is more appreciated. Because okay. niggas, don't, niggas don't get to see us all the mm-hmm, time. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So when niggas do see us, they're like, damn, what's up? We need to do this. We need to do that. I'm fucking with this. I'm fucking with that. Not saying that people here don't appreciate us, but niggas appreciate the work and, and you know what I mean? And, the, and right. the, uh, consistency and the consistency out of town in different places. But here, I get a lot of love here. You know what I mean? I appreciate the love, but, you know, it is what it is, though. No okay. doubt. I think uh, it's more of a, a, a thing like like Buffalo is funny. I think it's more of a thing like um, like when I'm being the eight and I live in Atlanta, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And I'm I'm like always there, and I fuck with a lot of niggas, like a lot of DJs, a lot of producers, and a lot of motherfuckers that do music, right. and a lot of motherfuckers who just a fan of uh, a new music, and right. Right. you know, motherfuckers is just they just see you for your potential and what yep. you bring into the table. It ain't about none of that other shit. I think here. I think um, motherfuckers got that. Who the fuck? Who we think he is? Right, like, right, right. You know right, what I'm saying? Right. Like before they want to show that love and support you and appreciate you. Like who this nigga think he is up now on they, stage? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now they Opening up the for future and uh-huh. Yo Gotti with yeah. 20 spades on stage uh-huh. and you know uh-huh. what I'm saying? His shirt, no shirt on with 20 chains on. Right. You know what I mean? Instead of just saying, Yo, that nigga look wavy up there. Right, he killing right, that right. shit. That's my nigga. He from the town world. 
You know what I mean? I think that's the difference between Buffalo and, and, and a lot of other places. Because it's so small. And everybody's so, you know what I mean, got they, that chip on their shoulder. So it's like nobody really want to see nobody win. Let's be honest. What's up? You know what I mean? What does it take? I mean, we all. I mean, everybody definitely agrees that that we need a winner. You know, at least not even that we need one, but that the town definitely looking for a winner. Yeah. You know, what does it take to uh to to unify wherever it comes from? You know, why hasn't it happened yet? Somebody got to win. <laughs> you know what <laughs> I'm saying? Not, niggas ain't not. gonna unify, and niggas ain't gonna get behind nothing, and niggas ain't gonna follow nobody that don't have the credentials right. to lead. You dig what I'm saying? Like, how yeah. I'm gonna fall in line with a motherfucker who ain't got a plaque on the wall? Right. Who ain't got a Grammy? Who ain't you know what I mean? Who ain't sat up with Dr. Dre? Who ain't been in meetings with Kevin right. Lyles and Leo right. Cohen? Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Right. How we going how, how you expect a nigga from the hood who been rapping on the corner <laughs> and saving up his bread to yep. go you know what I mean somewhere for twenty dollars an hour and record his mixtape? How you gonna get him to trust and believe in you? Right? You feel me? Like we this is a funny city, man. It's been a black cloud and nobody's succeeded and nobody really you know what I mean made it out. You like, think that be fucking a lot of the artists up because I, it's a it's a, it's a lot of them type of dreams being sold, right. and they 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 be in such a rush to want to be the first one to have whatever, do whatever anyway. It seems so far fetched to niggas, right? You got to think it's not reachable, it's not within niggas' grasp, right? You think what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Just just look at Atlanta. You know what I mean? Future right. is from right. Atlanta. Right. Like, right from the neighborhood. Right. Motherfuckers from the neighborhood is seeing somebody from their neighborhood actually make it. Right. Like like before. Like like going to the NFL and the NBA was kind of like far fetched, kind of like a, a, a fantasy in the right, city, right, right, right. because nobody was really making it. Now you got Corey Graham and them right. niggas, Mike Williams, you know what I mean, mm-hmm. niggas who actually mm-hmm. making it, and right. niggas who actually successful in it, you right, know what right, I mean. Right. So it's believable. Like damn, we might got a chance to make it in a mm-hmm. in, in the mm-hmm. NFL. Right. But rap is like ain't nobody made it. Ain't nobody, especially who you know, like you know what I mean. Put up Wayne or Drake numbers from Buffalo. Right, right, right. Nobody. Right. You think you know somebody I mean? can? And you think you can? A lot of people can, not just me. Right. A lot of people can. What's the uh? What's what, what's the reason that it doesn't happen? Is, is it is it that people don't unify? Is it a lack of resources? Is it it's, a? Uh, I think it's a lack of resources. Mm-hmm. I don't think um the the lack of unification is is, is the problem. No you doubt. You know what I mean? No I'm doubt. gonna be Glad honest you said with you. That. Glad you I'm said gonna that. be honest with you. Like niggas need to be in their own lane and do what they need to do. Right. Like you feel me? Mm-hmm. It's not hard. Like Yo Gotti right. didn't sign with nobody, and he getting forty a show, and he enjoying his life without a white man in his pocket. Right. You know what I mean? No offense. You dig what I'm saying? So it's not hard. It's not far fetched. What niggas gotta understand is, I mean, no disrespect to Buffalo. I love my hometown, mm-hmm. but nobody's coming here and checking for right. music. Right. If you go anywhere else, like you could go to an open mic night and. And fucking Jermaine Dupri is actually in there. Right. You know what I'm right. saying? Greg Street is actually there. Mm-hmm. Niggas who can change your life right. they hear your shit and like, right. yo, let me holler at you. Take mm-hmm. my number. Mm-hmm. It's not, ain't nobody going to the OHM. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. No disrespect. Right. You dig? So that's what's keeping, what's hindering a lot of niggas from, from um, making it because they so worried about unifying and right. just right. teaming up with, oh, right. man, right. we all need right. to get on the mixtape and just go yeah. instead of just trying to take <laughs> what they bring to the table and yeah. go to the right. labels themselves. Uh-huh. Like, go uh-huh. where the music is popping. Yeah. You dig what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. before I got blicked up, I was on my way. You right. know what I mean? Right, Not right, to right. toot my own horn. Like, right. I was in the right place, and I was doing the right things and mm-hmm. making the right moves. Uh-huh. I ain't going to give them niggas my playbook, but it was about to pop for me. Right. You feel me? Right. Niggas just got to just kill that whole unification shit, right. dog. Like, that shit don't mean nothing. Right. Niggas from New York don't like nowhere. Who ho fuck with in right. New York? Right. <laughs> Is, you know what I mean Who puff You know what I mean It's like Ain't nobody thinking about I mean everybody in New York We need to get on the joint Everybody in Atlanta Let's get on the mixtape And just Nah niggas is in their lane Gucci Mane don't fuck with Jeezy Right <laughs> You know what right. I'm saying Period Jeezy don't fuck with Gucci Mane And Walker mm-hmm. and them niggas And them niggas mm-hmm. all getting money You feel me Come on What's the uh What's, 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 what's the move outside of music It's um You know Anything Acting Fashion yeah, basically anything, anything you can get your hands into. Right. You know what I mean? Like, I uh, <laughs> I was a uh, approacher on a few little acting joints. Okay. I got, I got uh skipped over, dude. I was, I ended up uh getting locked back up. Right. And, uh, what's that shit? They uh, I forgot the uh movie. 
that the uh, Knuckle City film shot that's about to come out. It's, it's a Romans? Good, yeah, I seen uh, that. Uh, uh, joint, but okay. Corey Green, he approached me with with a part in that, but I was I wasn't around for that. But that's gonna be a good joint. Right. I would have loved I would have loved to get in some acting, uh, get my uh, motherfucking uh, get my shit on. I would yes, love sir. To get that. You know what I mean? <laughs> now, um, I mean. Mm-hmm. The Greed, you know what I'm saying? We're doing the Greed clothing line, too. Yes, you know sir. what I mean? That shit is already, you know what I mean? It's been a couple pieces already put together, you know what I mean, that, that motherfuckers is really enjoying and really liking. That's, it's going it's gonna to be in the streets. It's going to be in the stores real soon, you know what I mean? Very real soon. Very early 2014, trust me. Okay. You know what I mean? Look out for that Greed. We branding that. What's the uh, What's the, 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 the links for both the uh, contact if they, uh, you know, want to book, want to send some beats, anything? Get with me at uh, www dot motherfucking uh, basically first of all my Facebook shit but, yes know what I mean uh, f- uh www dot buff city records at uh, gmail mm-hmm. you know what I mean and uh seven one six eight three three zero two four seven that's been a number for so long yeah I mean I'm not giving y'all my uh, phone number y'all could be calling me and all type of crazy shit asking me to do features and shit I'm not about to Come shoot on. my phone number on here <laughs> I mean I'm not hard to find y'all see me at the uh, Ferry and Fillmore Gas and shit Come like on. that but for the people you know what I mean for for the people who who not in the city but 716-833-0247 get with me so still Buff City Buff City forever oh yeah that's a fact no doubt no yeah, doubt Buffs, yeah I mean that's the, that's the, always, that's the yeah. family you feel me why the uh why 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 you think the uh you know the talking why do you think the whispers you know what I mean because I mean I, I always you know I'm 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 of the the belief that if they talking about you know not so much that you're doing something right but at least at least you definitely being noticed you know to be mentioned by the circles that would never be you know mixing with each other. Who's talking about um you know? the 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 heckling and all that? Yeah, just niggas you know just 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 some little rumors that you know like you know niggas is uh, uh split up and and oh, you know they know oh, more. Oh, oh, that situation. You know? um, I don't know, man. I I don't I don't know why. You know, what I mean, people would assume that. I guess because if you really look at it, it ain't really been no um a collective piece of music right. from us in like but since like what. S E gang bang bang. Right. You know what I mean? Everybody been really doing their own thing. Like I've been coming with them bad side shits mm-hmm. and even coming with the Mayors backs and the and the and the, and the, right. uh, and the, and the American D boys and you know what I mean everything he been bringing to the table and West been doing him. You know what I mean? West niggas don't even be knowing there's been a lot of personal shit between niggas like right. you know what I mean? We lost Sheen Gun Black. Right. West side been in and out of the feds. Right. You know what I mean? That's right. our brother. That's my brother. That's his his cousin, you right, dig what I'm right. saying? He been in and out of the feds. He just dropped Hitler Wears Hermes mm-hmm. Part Two, which is crazy, by the way. Um, Definitely cracked. <laughs> uh, that's what it's been. I, I, it's just a simple fact that niggas ain't really just did no music together in so long. So motherfuckers are thinking like, oh, them boys on shit. Da 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 da. Niggas in the streets gonna talk and assume. You right. feel me? But this the family. You know what I mean? It is what it is. Can't nothing get you in think, the middle. Uh, of it. You think? You think being being nice and being relevant for for so long at and at a, a such an early situation for the, the 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 music scene out here, do you think that's that's now maybe hurting y'all because people are not so, not not so much that they they used to y'all because it's always some new shit but more so taking y'all for granted so that kind of you know the, the diminishes the, the the respect that you're supposed to get. It may, it may, but um you know. Niggas, I mean, I, me personally, I don't try to, you know what I mean, think about even that a right. little. Yeah, I, mean, I don't try to even let that shit bother me. I'm still me. moving. Yeah, I'm still doing me. Because I, yeah. I, I listen to everything. One thing about it, I'm a fan first. So, I listen to everything. Trust me. I've heard everything that right, right, right. dropped this right. year. Right, right. And I'm a, it's not fucking with nothing that I'm bringing to the table. No like, doubt. I'm going to just be real. If it was, i say it. Like, right. yo, yo, I ain't going to lie. My shit crazy, but yo, man, son coming with that. I'm telling you, watch what you hear his shit. Who y'all fuck with? Who y'all, who y'all listen to that y'all fuck with out here? I don't, I'm don't. i going to be honest with you, man. Niggas I fuck with, I, niggas know who I fuck with. They know who they is. Everybody, I don't fuck with nobody. I'm going to keep it on it. I dig I'm that. I'm Conway, man. I don't shout nothing out. I don't fuck with nobody. It is what it is. I'm my own entity. Yeah. You dig what I'm saying? As he is the gang, and that's it, man. Come on. You know what I mean? I I heard a lot of shit. I heard everything. I will say this. I heard everything. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And niggas I fuck with know I, I know fuck, I with, I fuck them. with them. You know what I mean? And that's yeah. it. Well, I want I want I want to speak on what you were saying about like how, do it hurt niggas that niggas been on the run for so long? I feel like I feel like 
fifty fifty on that as well. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It 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 do because these simple minded ass niggas. They you know what I mean? Like like I said in the one song, man. I've been uh, winning so long and feeling so strong. It hurt them to know that Durant ain't winning over LeBron. You Come know on. What I mean? It ain't the fact that people want to see Durant win. They just want to see the good niggas lose. You know right. what I mean? So, and and that, and that's acceptable because I understand how some people think. But mm-hmm. you know what I mean, but how 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 niggas is feeling and you know their personal feelings that can that don't affect my pen game. That don't mm-hmm. affect how I perform on these beats. Right, you know right. I mean? Period. <laughs> Period. You know what I mean? Right. That's so, mm-hmm. so they could. They street persona, like right. that the homie right. was saying, like, niggas get shit twisted because we trying yep. to just be more humble and more right. friendly. Just the uh, cause we dealing with a lot of a lot of bigger business. Like we dealing with a lot of motherfuckers that ain't in the things we into. Mm-hmm. You dig what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Mm-hmm. We walking into a lot of offices and, and shaking a lot of hands. Right. And you know what I mean? When you dealing with the street, one thing I'm gonna leave these niggas with, man, you got to know what the lead what the what the what to bring with you and what the lead right. behind. Right. 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 Bro. Come on. Come with on. the street Come shit, on. my nigga. You can't right. take this shit in, right. in this office, man, with these people, man. That's real you shit. dig what I'm saying? So we, we might, you know, sometimes we lose focus and lose track and let niggas, niggas might think they could just get over. Like, right. the whole right. situation with the niggas dissing and shooting like little shots. Like, mm-hmm. niggas might think niggas ain't responding this, that, and the third. They got it all, oh, man. Let's right. yeah, yeah, yeah. We, 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 man, the niggas can't fuck with us. Like, man, listen, bro. <laughs> Ask your bitch. Ask your homie right. that you grew up with. Right. Ask your big homie. Mm-hmm. Ask your mama. Ask anybody about Chains and Conway, nigga. Mm-hmm. Ask about Benny and Conway. Right. That's all. Come on. That's a TV show in itself right there. Right, right. Benny and Conway. Right, right, Come right. on, man. That shit, that shit gonna have to be on... That shit gonna have to be on Showtime or something. It's Come on. X-rated. I yeah, dig that. Yeah. Now, um, the label come, whatever label come, what's uh, what's the move? What's 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 good enough for you to be like? Yeah, I can go ahead and accept that. You know, is it is it the full the full promotion and and, and the distribution? You know, the um the 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 marketing or you know what is it that it make you move from the independent? I mean, because shit, boys, they um you know at least at least from a from a, from a notoriety standpoint is uh gravy on the independent route but you know when that when when that major come talking what does you know what 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 it make you listen see what's, what's gonna make me listen is 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 a is a uh, opportunity right you know what i mean like you could you could throw a number at me mm-hmm. as, a, as far as financial situation but if if the opportunity not there i might as well uh, right. keep doing what i'm doing mm-hmm. you know what i mean i need mm-hmm. an opportunity like if you could you can guarantee me an opportunity to be the <clears throat> to, uh, to have to uh to accumulate some Drake numbers, a little okay. lane numbers, or right. something like that. If I could, uh, if I'm presented that opportunity, that's different. If I'm presented a few dollars in a shelf, <laughs> you know right. what I mean. I want an opportunity. Right. That's what I want. You know what I mean. But mm-hmm. at the end of the day, like I like I tell a lot of niggas this, like with with, with what I've been doing, my uh, a deal would be great. But that's not my that's not my uh, right. that's not that's not why I'm in this in the booth every day. That's mm-hmm. not why I'm mm-hmm. working hard and going on these in these beats. It's not. To get a deal and a deal and deal, cause like we seen like a lot of niggas is eating without even ever right. sitting down right. with these people. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. A lot of niggas is eating and, and never met the Kevin Lyles and mm-hmm. never met the, the liars and never never even met them. And he and he got a sixty two outside. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So so that's what that's a wave I'm on. I just wanna uh, I just wanna make a situation for myself where I could feed my family, I could pay my bills, and I could. And I could pull up in something and I could be comfortable Come on. without none of that. You know what I mean? Come on. So, and that's what it is with me. That's, that's pretty much where I stand on this shit. Um, I'm not really, um, you know what I'm saying, pressed to uh, talk to no, really no labels and right. none of that. Right, yeah. I mean, if they come, I'm definitely going to listen and have that sit down. Um, I want to have them sit down. But for me to actually, you know what I mean, engage in anything of that magnitude... Everything got to be right. Like, mm-hmm. it just, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? It, it just got to be the perfect situation, the ideal situation for me and my family and mm-hmm. the team. You know what I mean? And then we'll talk other than that. Like, you know what I mean? The streets love me. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? The people mm-hmm. love me. Mm-hmm. I still live in the hood. Come on. I love it. The people love me. The streets love me. So it's Now, what's the, uh, what's, the, what's, the, what's the separation? That's something I ask people a lot. 
you know i mean because everybody had got however they feel about themselves you know but uh what's 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 y'all separation you know when y'all step step wherever and you know any room any building what you know lets you know and the fuck letting you know you know what what lets them know that y'all definitely different than whatever it is that they used to american greed come on um, the transition <laughs> <laughs> the transition too. Yes, sir. Welcome to the bad side. Mm-hmm. Welcome back to the bad side. Mm-hmm. Um, se gang bang bang, and you know what I mean. Tanner talk right? too. Now, 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 just just with that for both of y'all. <laughs> yeah, past man. uh uh past past being dope and having a name. Do y'all think that 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 y'all get enough to, uh credit for the body of work? Not you know not 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 like a respect, but do do you think that niggas give y'all enough credit for the for the work and for the songs that they know y'all put in whether they heard them or not? Uh, I really yo on some real shit, my nigga. Like mm-hmm. I really don't even want to answer that question because I don't want to even sound like a uh, crying. Yeah, yeah I got like you. But <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna be. I gotta I keep it a hundred because you ask me, uh-huh. bro. Uh-huh. Like I don't feel as though niggas get enough credit, man. You dig what I'm saying? And, and I say that, not just saying far as, like, niggas supposed to be, like, you know, bowing and niggas' feet or whatever. Yeah, not at all. But it's like, yo, what we did at the time and the era we did it, like, you yeah, gotta understand, dog. Mm-hmm. Like, when we was coming with the with the raw shit out, you had g in and they prime. Right. Dipset and they prime. Right. Mm-hmm. D-Block and they prime. Killing mm-hmm. shit, bro. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? I always looked at shit from a, a, a from a whole, you know, industry, you know what I mean, point of view. I ain't right, never right, looked at right, shit like, right. uh, of course against, not. I never was against the city because right. I felt like, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, shit, we, we, we all won. Like, right. I'm not right. trying to be, I'm not, you know, we all in the same boat. Best we trying down. to get to the same right. place. So right. it's like, mm-hmm. I'm not basing my shit on land as I'm, as I'm, as I'm killing this nigga, the next nigga, I'm the eldest nigga in the town. Mm-hmm. That never was my pitch on shit. Right. You know what I mean? I always looked at shit like as the industry and the hottest niggas in the game. We can all How agree is right. is G was G Unit and the mm-hmm. O three mm-hmm. and the yep. you know what I'm saying? That time it was that it was time. G Unit, Dipset. Mm-hmm. You feel me? D Block. You right. know what I mean? Right. Probably from a New York State right. point of view. Uh-huh. And we was coming with that shit. shit. You uh-huh. dig what I'm saying? Uh-huh. We was coming with that shit that inspired a lot of niggas. <laughs> you know what I mean? I ain't gonna say niggas' names. You know what I mean? But a lot of niggas. I don't even know half the niggas. I ain't yeah. met them yet. They yeah. know me though. Yeah. They know chains. Yeah. You feel me? A lot yeah. of niggas been inspired by the shit that we brought to the table at a time when New York State was kind of had it, it kind of had life. Come on. You know what I mean? Because right. if you look at it since them times, ain't nobody really sold no numbers or did nothing. Only one fucking one platinum from from uh, New York State, if, if I'm not mistaken, is Nicki Minaj and ASAP. Rocky, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and I feel like what we bring to the table is just as good as, if not better, than what they bring to the table. Yeah. So, and we've been doing it for so long, so right. niggas, niggas try to just, you know, niggas want they shot, and niggas gotta just understand, man. We not trying to keep y'all from having y'all shot. Mm-hmm. Do what y'all do. We want niggas the more. We right. need niggas. Right, right. You know what I mean? Right. Killing shit. Let's go. Kick the door. In. Come Somebody. On. Somebody. You right. feel me? Like uh-huh. that ain't my. Thing. I'm not trying to get in the way of you. I'm mm-hmm. not at war with you. Right. You know what I mean? I'm not right. against you, right. dog. Like, and that's to, I'm telling everybody, everybody, like anybody that ever diss me or anybody that do music. You know what I mean? I, it's, it's not me against you, man. Yeah. It's, it's, it's us against the industry. Mm-hmm. Now, what you gonna do? Right. Because I'm doing my part. I done my part. Right. Bill Belichick of this shit, my nigga. Let's go. And that's and that's and that's I, I stand the same way, like. A lot of niggas feel like niggas be in their way. Ain't nobody in niggas' way, you know what mm-hmm. I mean? Like, I, I'm going to keep shit all the way 100. I was talking to somebody uh, yesterday, just yesterday. And then uh, he was like, man, he was like, man, somebody said you fell off. But <laughs> I'm like, fell off? Like, when, when like, like okay, if I put if I put some music out and then, like, the, the streets tell me, yo, we love that shit. I, I, I appreciate that. But when, like, niggas who I be around every day. Mm-hmm. Who, who know my best and seen my worst mm-hmm. and tell me, yo, you, my nigga, that right got something right. That that's when I know I got something. Mm-hmm. And like mm-hmm. with that, with the with the best ever, you know what I mean? That I'm I'm so personal on my right. uh, my last project. You know Man. what I mean? Like go download that, Damn take a listen, everything. that piff yeah. mm-hmm. Take a listen and like my niggas been telling me, yo, that's that thing. And I and I listen and I try to step outside myself and take a listen. And I feel like niggas. A lot of people trying to say like the boys ain't where they was, but 
niggas is just spoiled. Mm-hmm, right. You know what right. I mean? To, to that's, the, that's what I was saying. Niggas when I was is just saying, spoiled. Like, like it ain't what it was, so it ain't, but, it's, uh-huh. but it's, it's still a boys, you know what I mean? So. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. right, yeah. See, that's, yeah. What I was, that's what I was telling somebody, to, uh, and that's, and that, that's the conversation I had with somebody yesterday too. <laughs> when they was like, they was like, well, you know what? That shit right there, you got right there. I was telling them about my new shit. They was like, well, this shit, that shit, that shit. I said, well, you telling me about my old shit? That's the same right, thing. It's like, right, we going? Right. Let's say we going out tonight, <laughs> and I got a pocket full mm-hmm. of money. I can mm-hmm. motherfucking go anywhere, buy whatever the fuck I want, Robins, whatever. You know what I mean? And right. the nigga like, nigga like. Wear something. You should wear something out the closet. You got dope shit fresh out the cleaners. Right. Like, nigga, I'm going to get something new. You know right. what I mean? Check this right. new shit out. Right. Fuck what you talking about that old shit. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. dope, but check what I got right now. Right. You know what I mean? And, and we artists. Like, niggas, this a fucking, this a, this a V12 right. engine. Come on. Under this, under this hat right here. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's a V12. So I'm not worried about the old oh, shit. Yeah, you know what I mean? Now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the, the streets logged in, man. Yeah. I hope the streets is logged in. Y'all getting a lot. Uh, 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 niggas don't even really open up and do this. Like right. you getting a real. Right. We being one hundred. Like and we giving y'all. We gonna get like we gonna get y'all an extra couple minutes and all that, man. My nigga, <laughs> ask what you wanna ask, man. Shoot, shoot now, the uh, questions out, man. I definitely you know? wanna um the uh music. Each one of y'all. What was y'all y'all? I guess favorite favorite time. Favorite uh favorite project, you know, whatever whatever project it was, you know, what was the best time period for whatever project? From us or from uh, uh, no and, 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 individually, anything that you've done, you know, any uh mixtape or uh you know album, anything, any <laughs> compilation. That um, for me, what, what era was the, the the best for you? I would say I got three three eras where it was kind of like I, I knew I was in my zone and where I needed to be mm-hmm. mentally and lyrically. Um. I'ma say, um, when we did that S E gang bang bang. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I was kinda like I lost my mind. I was listening <laughs> to that shit the other day kinda like I yeah. lost I lost my we all lost our mind. Yeah you do. Westside got the hardest shit on there. But niggas kinda like lost their mind on that shit. Come on. That and that K Slay shit, but on that S E gang bang bang niggas went crazy like um I would say the transition because that was a time, you know what I mean, like, and I go back to the shit you asked me with the whole, uh, why niggas think the Buff City shit split up or whatever. Mm-hmm. It wasn't no animosity, it wasn't no problems, it wasn't no, nothing like that. Mm-hmm. But I actually recorded the transition, a lot of niggas don't know this, I recorded the transition in um, the nigga Jay Long studio. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean, mm-hmm. over there with, with Stairs and 22, right, 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 right. you dig right. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And... Just me being a competitive nigga, like like Benny was saying, like I just like yo, these niggas don't know my potential. Like Benny know, like niggas know, like I'm about to kill these niggas. Right, right, like I love right. stairs of twenty two. They're my brothers. They're mm-hmm. my niggas. Right, like shout out to the old TME battles, right, right. Hezzy Heads. You know what I mean? The right. Stairs and them niggas. I, then they they know what it is. I fuck with them niggas, but my whole mind state was that like, everything because they was right there where I'm writing and recording shit. Right, right, right. So I'm like. I gotta get these niggas. They gotta hear the. Right. They gotta hear the the, the the dopest shit I can can cop right, right now. Right. So that and that right there in an American greet, man. That was just a yeah. comfortable time right. period right. for me, man. Yeah, the man. bread was around, man. Niggas was living. <laughs> you know what I mean? That ATL life ain't nothing like that right. ATL right. life, man. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. Believe that, man. When yeah. you're driving a nice sports car, man. Uh-huh. You know you looking good. You feeling good feeling every good. day, man. Uh-huh. Got about a hundred bitches in my phone, man. Come on. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. Pocket full of, you know what I mean? Fat heads, right. Then frizzies, right? You know what I mean? Come on. It was it was beautiful. I was at man. the, uh, I recorded that at the Artist Factory. You know what I mean? Atlanta. No doubt. I did. I just wanted to get niggas like eight songs, just body shit. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But that was that, them them three periods was it for me. And Tana talk too. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> That's my uh, everything we ever did. Okay. Even I did like yeah. Tana talk too was my favorite yeah. period. Uh, and my first one, it is the Tanner Talk to. Okay. Because that was my first, first solo project. Right. And and really like recording that whole fucking project, mm-hmm. I knew that shit was dope. Right. I right. knew that shit uh-huh. was dope. But right. the first day it came out, I had butterflies in my stomach because I was questioning myself because right, right. I'm I'm by myself. Even mm-hmm. though the right. boys was all over that, that shit could have been mm-hmm. called motherfucker. That shit could have been called S E Gang. Right. You know what I mean? 
<laughs> it was. Listen, listen. This this what they this what they don't know. It was supposed to. It, it was supposed to been an SE project. Right. You know what I mean? Right. But we, we just wrapped it up and it was a Benny project. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. and, and and that and that's that's fact. You know what I mean? Never even nobody never even knew that. Right. You know what I mean? So. Right. 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 Come on. Right. Come on. Right. How uh? And then <laughs> and then when it came out, remember we went to the A. Me, you, and City Boy. We had a fucking no blast. Doubt. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, stayed at my mama crib. Exactly. We all standing on couches with T.I., Mike Vick, Club 112. Exactly. Niggas was like, I felt niggas was standing on their own too. When niggas was out of right. town popping right. bottles, doing shit without the team. Right. You know what I mean? Just on their own too, just off of, you know what I mean? So that tend to talk too. Right. right, you think right, that's right. good? Do you? I mean, you, you you think it's good to go? You know, to go elsewhere and and, and feel that appreciation. Not so much that niggas need it's validation, it's, but it's, you know, honey, it's detrimental to your to your whole to your whole career because yeah. it's like you gotta you gotta have like nobody actually said. That's the thing about these niggas, man. You know what I mean? These rap niggas here in in, in, in the city, like. Niggas be dropping all these projects and these mixtapes these that ain't anticipated. <laughs> right. There's no anticipation. Right. There's no want. There's no we are not looking for it. We're not checking for it. Like you right. have to like you have a show that the people like you. Actually mm -hmm. like right. your shit. Right. right. Or like right. you. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, like you got you. your homies. Uh, okay, yeah, niggas is big and you are uh, okay. But you ain't really went nowhere and did nothing and, sh and shown and proved that motherfuckers actually like you and actually like what you bring to the table. Right, right. So you got to go elsewhere to, to kind of like, you know what I mean, just to test the waters with your shit. Right. You know what I mean? And like right. I was saying before, nobody is here actually checking for shit. Mm -hmm. So it's like if you make a music, you just believe in it here. It's like the projects you going to get is... uh. You know, Bandana Black playing it on Saturday night at right. 2 in the morning. Right. And no disrespect to nothing yeah. that Bandana Black is doing because that's my brother. Right. And he do a lot for me and what I'm trying to do and bring to the table. But it's like, niggas feel like when they hear they shit, okay, Bandana played it, they feel like they they They, they, they uh, won. They won the finish it's line. Over. Right. They crossed the finish In line. Game. Uh -huh. My shit in King City. My shit in King City. Bandana played my shit. Yeah. It's over. I'm good. I got my like, mixtape hosted. I, I never, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to say this. And I don't, yeah. there's no disrespect to no yeah. nigga. But I don't really give a fuck how nobody feel. But I ask myself, why have I not never heard none of these niggas shit in Nord? Right. Or right. Buffalo Live. Right. Or none of the clubs that I go to mm -hmm. frequently. Mm -hmm. Why? You know what I mean? Why would right. I go to the club? I was, why was I hearing Migos two years ago? Right. <laughs> in the right. club. Why right. was I hearing Future? You know what I'm saying? A year before uh -huh. Tony Montana was come played on, in come Buffalo. On. Right. You know what I'm saying? But why when I come here, I don't hear nobody mm -hmm. from the town in right. none of the spots, in right. the clubs. Yeah, that's, crazy. that's crazy. Niggas need to ask themselves that. Right. That's crazy. Come on. And like, and like, <laughs> like, we're back to the other question. Like, you, you can't tell niggas that they not on the same level as niggas when, like you said, they shit in King City. A few, right, a few slots down. From right, I'm about to say, yeah, it's right next to yours. And then, and then, they, and then, they, and then band in the black play this, play they shit. And then niggas say, man, I'm not supposed to pay for your feature. Shit. You know, you know what I mean? Like oh, these that. niggas know. Oh, these niggas know. They can't get many <laughs> on nothing for if it ain't about no green bags. Yeah, you know I mean, niggas can't get me on nothing. But got to. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> hey yo, but look, but look though, cause we talking about some real shit. I'm gonna take mm -hmm. it back to the other question where you're mm -hmm. saying like, what's what's this times of the right, CDs and right, shit? Right. What I want to say is that motherfucking uh, when I when I came home and I did that D Boy One and you had that what's the name shit out. You know what I mean, what was that? The bad side too. Welcome back to the bad side. Yeah, yeah. Come you on. Had that shit. Cause, yeah, cause when I I came home, you know what I mean, I was I was in the feds in Ashland, Kentucky, and I rolled back eight <laughs> hours. Mm -hmm. Just playing this nigga shit, and I'm Come like, on. "What the fuck?" Right. I was just that was like I was like in the gym listening mm -hmm. to that shit, mm -hmm. and when I got back, I did that. I did that D boy one. Yeah. And that's, then I did five of them. D -boy, right. Right. You know right. I, mean? I did. Yeah. I stretched that shit out. You know what I mean? Which one was the best? West was locked up. Come on. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. For 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 one for like if like for yeah, two yeah, days yeah, for two yeah. days the whole S E gang was was locked up. Sheen <laughs> gun was gone. <laughs> I mean, like when I did that, a lot of niggas, a lot of niggas was gone when I did that. Uh, right, right, that right. double CD, Welcome Back to the Bad Side. Uh -huh. A lot of niggas was locked up, so I felt a lot of pressure. I ain't even gonna lie, niggas don't know. Like I felt weight on my shoulders. Like right. damn, right. I ain't really got. You know what I mean? Because I know the type of shit that I bring to the table and how I give it up. Like my flow is kind of aggressive. Like I'm coming mm -hmm. at niggas next. Mm -hmm. Ball. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So it's like damn, man. It's like you feel me? Like have you ever seen Juice? How yeah. pop? 
Got you know what I mean? When he's when he's seen the homies coming out the block, he right. well, fuck you, yeah, yeah, yeah. He right. go with his shit. Like I'm going with my shit, but right. the homies all locked up. So I'm like, damn, man, you feel me? Right. But I just that's where that bad side two came from, man. West was locked up, Benny was locked up, Cut Dog had to go do his two. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So it was like, I, ooh, shit. I gotta come with my shit. Real shit. You know what I mean? Respect. Matter of fact, then he did this joint over the phone. Like, I don't know how the fuck you got on the on the bad side too. But you was on that shit from the from the vets. Right. That's crazy. They put that together. Yeah. That's love. That's all the way love. Um closing out anything we uh any anything we miss, anything we ain't they ain't touch on real quick that uh they need to know. Man, I don't or that you know, that, man. that you go care on, to let them know. Go on datpev.com and, and, and download all that shit. Listen to that shit. Mm-hmm. That Benny, that best ever in New York. That's my, that's my latest shit. I'm going crazy on that. I'm real personal on that shit. You got that uh, on my mama then. Yeah. You know what I mean? You yeah. got and, and and what I'm working on now. I'm really it's me and 38. Uh, we doing a cocaine cowboys too. Shout you know out to the homie special. Yeah, yeah. We we doing a cocaine cowboys too. Yeah. Come we on. just we just did a song for it the other night. Know what I mean? Yeah. Right, right. You know what I mean? Y'all got some uh uh, uh favorite collabs with y'all, you know what I mean? Top top uh top five collabs if y'all got them. Um I'm I ain't really uh, man, that's a tough question for right. me because you know I don't really fuck I don't I don't do the whole collabing right. with niggas. I don't you know what I mean? It'll be all team records. It'll be all team, <laughs> but one that I really uh-huh. enjoyed doing was with my nigga uh Low Pro. You okay. know what I mean? I okay. did some shit no with Low Pro, free Low Pro, he on no his way home too, but I did a joint with him. I did some shit with Baddish. Um, I did some shit with um, a couple niggas. I don't even remember. Right, 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 right. My shit is my shit's always it's gonna always be me and the homie if that even count. You know what I mean? And uh, right. Yeah, you know what I mean. And rest in peace, Shane Gun Black. Like me no and doubt. my brother got no to doubt. do something. And 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 it felt and it felt good when to, to do a song with my brother when niggas was checking for him. You know what I mean? Right. He's always asking me to do songs. Right. Man, you know what I mean? Right. Come on. I, when I, when I had a situation, niggas was checking for him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's, let's right, yeah. Always, always the homie D Black. That's my Rest nigga. in peace. Yeah, no oh, exactly. Mm-hmm. Right, right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. D Black was my nigga, like, on a personal level. Change, too. Right. You know what I mean? Right. Like, D Black was, a, I'm going to tell you, man, first and foremost, because I knew him personally. Right. He was a real nigga, man. He, he, was a, he was a genuine person. You know what I mean? He, he really showed love and he meant it. If he ain't fuck with you, he ain't fuck he ain't with you. Fuck he kept with it you. Right. You know what I mean? And that was my nigga, man. It fucked me up. You know what I mean? I still mm-hmm. got the text in my phone. I never deleted it. It's actually like a couple days, like two, three mm-hmm. days before, you know what I mean, he got murdered. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And and when he got killed, that shit fucked me up, man. Oh, but, you know what I mean? Download that greed, man. Download. I got, you know what I mean, my single greed on iTunes. You feel me? Get American Greed. That shit's still available. Physical therapy on the way. Mm-hmm. The Devil's Reject is on the way. You know what I mean? Look out for that greed. You know what I mean? Clothing line and accessories. That shit coming, you know what I mean? Early spring. You know what I mean? Just just be on the lookout, man. I'm coming. We branding. We building our brand, man. You feel me? Come on. It's going down. Come on. Follow me on Twitter. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. You already know all my information. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Follow me on Twitter. Who is Conway? Instagram, Conway, underscore, the, underscore, machine. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, you know what I mean? At YouTube.com, backslash, Conway, greed, all one word. Um, Reverb Nation, backslash, Jimmy Conway. Um, You know what I mean? That Piff, Live Mix, everything, you know what I mean? Just just, just Google Jimmy Conway. Just Google Conway, you're going to find everything, man. Shout out to the gang, man. S.E. is the gang, you heard? That's what it is. Now Shout out to the substation for having niggas too, man. Yeah. <laughs> MySubstation.com. Got the homie Conway. Yeah, man. Got I hope y'all was tuned in. Yeah, man. Real 2 Chain. Buff City. SC Gang. Make sure I get that best ever shit. That shit in stores and available. Make sure I get that Hitler Wears Hermes 2 Westside Gun shit. It's in stores. It's available for download. And mm. make sure you get American Greed. You know what I mean? Which is one of the most profound mixtapes the streets have heard in a long time. Yeah, you know I man. One more before we uh, uh before we all the way cut. What's the uh, what's 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 the end game? What's the uh, what's what's the finishing? You know, when you sitting back and you got your feet up and you like, yeah, I, I I did what I came to do. Um, the end game for me is when I'm on a, um when I'm respected and looked at on a rock him level. 
on a big level, on a on a pop level, on a whole level, on a Nas level, because I feel like that's what I bring to the table. Like you know what I mean? I, I, I'm I'm that nice. No in doubt. my opinion, you know what I mean? <laughs> so it, it, until I get the respect and the recognition that those guys like that have got, and a mm-hmm. few others that I forgot to name, mm-hmm. I, my work is far from done. Right, right. The end game for me is like I stated earlier is is when I'm able is able to uh, solely live off this music, shit. right? Just, right. just what I love doing. You know what I mean? I'm paying my mortgage with that. Take care of the kids, take care of wifey, just doing all that shit with from music, you know what I mean? That's gonna be a blessing when niggas ain't got to look over their shoulder. Niggas right, ain't right, got right. to be in them kitchens, be in right, them, right. them back blocks. Come on. You know what I mean? Like niggas is doing it all for <laughs> off of music, you know what yeah. I mean? That'd be a beautiful thing, you know what no I mean? Doubt. That's what it is for me. That's what it is then. My substation.com people. Right, right. You already right. know what it is. Substation streaming.net, substation live.net, substation streaming.com, my substation.com. Wolvesden.com, nymcs.com. Uh, don't forget if you are uh, if you need a taxi, we got ASAP Taxi Service. Shout out to Wishful Ink and Tattoos as well. Around the corner on uh, Niagara, Jersey. I mean, you know what it is though. Uh, uh, I mean, Wishful Ink and it's all all substation umbrella. Get at us. Um, we got the uh, we got the open mics that I was talking about. We got the open mics coming. Um, but yeah, my substation.com people.